Hi, I'm Gary Thales, President of City Theatrical, and I'll be training you today in our vertical extension tubes. Vertical extension tubes are a safe, easy, and reliable way to hang a lighting fixture below a horizontal pipe. First, I'll show you how they're constructed and what makes them so strong. The heart of the VET is a piece of half-inch threaded rod that extends all the way through. That means the VET is not just a piece of hollow tubing with screw fittings on the end, but rather is an extremely strong hanging device with a stable core. One end has a stub of half-inch rod, and the other a half-inch coupler, which is pinned through the half-inch rod so it can't loosen. The vertical extension tubes come in three sizes, the 6-inch number 091, the 12-inch number 093, and the 24-inch number 095. The VETs can be easily connected together to achieve many different sizes. They actually can be screwed together into very long lengths, even 10 to 20 feet if you need a particularly long tail down. The set screw locks the sections together for safety. There are two hanging options for the VET itself. The first is with a standard C-clamp. Just remove the half-inch bolt from the C-clamp and screw the VET into it. Tighten down the set screw on the VET so it can't loosen. The second option is to use our number 090 VET adapter for split couplers and mount the VET to a half coupler. To use the adapter, simply thread the coupling shaft onto the thread of the bolt. Tighten down with an Allen key. Now to screw the VET into the coupling shaft. Finally, tighten down the set screw on the VET to join the vertical extension tube to the split coupler. Here's how VETs are used in the theater. Hanging multiple types of lighting fixtures on one pipe can cause problems for lighting designers. Differences in size and positioning can create unwanted obstructions. If you have moving lights and conventionals on the same pipe, vertical extension tubes allow you to align the lenses of the fixtures at the same height so the fixtures don't interfere with the equipment around them. Here's a city theatrical auto yoke hanging next to a Source 4 ellipsoidal. In certain focus positions, the beam of the Source 4 will hit the auto yoke. Here's the same rig with a 6 inch vertical extension tube on the Source 4. By lowering the lens 6 inches, all focus positions can be accommodated. Another use for vertical extension tubes is to create sculpted pipe bends. Here are three Source 4s with a 6 inch, a 12 inch, and an 18 inch vet hung as pipe ends. Screwing together a 6 inch and 12 inch vet made the 18 inch vet. The vertical extension tubes can also be used with track tamers on Unistrut or other C form channel. Just remove the hex bolt from the track tamer and the VET can be screwed into place. There are a few safety concerns for you to consider. Vertical extension tubes are designed to be used only in the downward hanging position because that's the way they're the strongest. Never hang them straight out or overhang them. The weight limit of VETs is 50 kilograms or about 100 pounds as they are designed to hang one lighting fixture each. Vertical extension tubes are, are compatible with C-clamps, track tamers, and each other, and they create a safe and easy way to hang a lighting fixture below a horizontal pipe. Thank you.